What's up, YouTube? Robert LaRocco here once again. Guys and gals, I want to have a conversation. We need to talk about the people complaining about Cyberpunk 2077. Now, here is the thing about Cyberpunk 2077. Number one, I don't own the game. So, therefore, I really can't say the game sucks if it's good or whatever. But I'm going to say this. From the stories I have been reading online and people's experiences with the bugs and the glitches and, you know, things that are happening with the game. Let me tell you something. If you're taking the time to bitch, moan, cry, and complain about the bugs and the glitches in Cyberpunk 2077, you've clearly never played Ark Survival Evolved. Clearly. Because Ark is more of an in-depth game than probably in Cyberpunk, okay? Ark, you spend hours on end doing something and then losing it all due to a bug. Ark, you have a big, beautiful, sexy base that that is going well and, and everything is successful on Ark, but the Wildcard Studios decide to put out an update and fucks the map up. And everything corrupts. And then you lose it all. You lose months and months of work. That's ARC for you. You Cyberpunk 277 guys. You all need to understand. It is a gaming industry. You're going to have bugs. There's no getting away from bugs. You're going to have them. Give these developers a break. They wasn't even sure if they wanted to release it. But you get the big wigs upstairs wasn't saying put it out we need the money blah, 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 blah. and now they're suing now they're suing the the the, the Pro cd project red now they're suing them over this game why because it's, it wasn't ready y'all rushed them out the door y'all took the five minutes of y'all's time to do that shit to these people come on man we like joe biden over here come on man Ugh. Ark was extremely buggy when it released. Wildcard got it under control. No one went off and sued fucking Wildcard. No. You want to know why? Because they knew they had to get it right. They knew they had to they had to fix it. And they did. And it's not fully fixed because the game is so complex. It takes time for a small independent studio to do something like that. This is the second biggest game CG Project Red has brought out. The other one was the Witcher series. And now there's this. Give them some credit, man. They're not EA. It's something different. Something we're enjoying. Something that they're actually trying to do. Until next time, you all take it easy. And y'all have a blessed, safe new year. And stay away from the COVID. Yeah.